On Saturday, Liverpool drew with Crystal Palace, ending their two-game winning streak in the English Premier League. With the result, the team sits in seventh place with 36 points, six points behind Tottenham, the first club outside of the Champions League qualification zone, although they have played one more game. In their next match, Klopp's men face Wolverhampton. The ball will roll on Wednesday at 5 p.m., Brasilia time, as the home team, at Anfield Road. In the middle of the table, Crystal Palace has 27 points. In the 26th round of the English Premier League, the team will face Aston Villa on the 4th of March at 12 p.m. away from home, at Villa Park. The game. Early in the match, Liverpool had the opportunity to score. At 10 minutes, Gakpo sprinted and passed to Sulla, who shot just wide of the left post. After a bad clearance, Alisson came out well and touched it for a corner. Later on, Diogo Hoda picked up the rebound and shot, but the goalkeeper managed to make the save in two attempts. In continuation of the pressure, the Portuguese hit the post. In response, Mark Gahey headed the ball and almost opened the scoring for Crystal Palace. Shortly after, Ala shot, the ball deflected, and narrowly missed the goal. In the end, in another defensive mistake by Liverpool, Jean-Philippe Matita hit the crossbar. Just like in the first half, the game was lively. Sulla unleashed a left-footed bomb that hit the crossbar. Then, Alexander-Arnold shot without an angle, and the goalkeeper parried it. Afterwards, the ball fell to Modip, who shot, but the goalkeeper made a good save. Until the end of the game, Liverpool battled to open the scoring. The number 11 made a good play and served Gakpo, who wasted the chance to score. In conclusion, although Liverpool had several chances to score and take the win, the match ended in a draw. The team now has to focus on their next game against Wolverhampton to keep their hopes alive for a Champions League spot. Please don't forget to like and subscribe for more updates on Liverpool and the English Premier League.